Monsome News Agency informs. Two new one-stop service centers for survivors of gender-based and domestic violence were launched in the Chingolte and Sukhbatur districts of Ulaanbaatar by the United Nations Population Fund and the Ministry of Labor and Social Protection. Under the project co-funded by the UNFPA, a Swiss development agency in the government of Mongolia, the two new centers are established with the 470 million Tugruks financial support of the combating gender-based violence in Mongolia. Project co-founded by UNFPA, the Swiss Agency for Development and Cooperation, and the Government of Mongolia to strengthen the country's capacity to respond to and prevent gender-based violence, especially domestic violence and the district governments are also provided venue and funding for the staff to work at the OSSCs. With these two new centers are among the 11 OSSCs are established under the project support and now in total 17 OSSCs for domestic violence survivors supported by UNFPA is working throughout the country. The Chingolte and Suhbatur OSSCs in particular were established to respond to the sharp increase in GBV survivors seeking help since the government put in place stringent restrictions to control, contain and prevent the spread of COVID-19 in the country. In the first quarter of 2020, when the restrictions were at their strictest, OSSC supported by UNFPA saw an 87% increase in the number of clients compared to the same period in 2019. It is well documented globally that GBV risks increase in emergency situations. In the Mongolian context, the COVID-19 pandemic and the precautionary measures have led to a rise in psychological and financial stress among families, which creates tension in relationships that could escalate to abuse of partners and neglect of children. To mitigate these growing risks, UNFPA has been working with the government of Mongolia, fellow UN agencies, as well as donors such as the SDC and the government of Japan to ensure continued access to GBV services during this time, as well as to promote healthy coping mechanisms to help prevent GBV from happening altogether.